My name is Demetrius Williams and I'm the principal of Early College High School. I have been in education for 27 years. I've been at Early College a total of probably seven years, but this is my second year as principal. I've been at Early College in, in some interesting capacities. My first time here at Early College, I was an avid elective teacher and a social studies teacher. And then I returned back to Early College as an instructional coach, and I remained in that role for about four years before becoming an administrator and now returning as a principal. What I love most about this school is that our students have the opportunity to begin their journey towards their career paths, whether it's taking college classes to earn them an associate's degree or taking college classes that put them right into the workforce. Um, AVID is our college readiness program and it stands for advancement via individual determination. Um, AVID has a special place in my heart because I am the first in my family to actually graduate from college. I attended Coastal Carolina University and I'm the first in my family. I'm actually the first female in my immediate family to have a high school diploma. So that was very important to my mom. And my mom knew that the value of an education and she wanted me to go to college, but she knew the importance of understanding financial aid and scholarships. But not having had that experience, she made sure to put me around people in the community who had experience going to college. Or uh, if she knew of someone that um, went to college, she figured, okay, if they've gone to college and they must know how to do a college application, they must know how to do a financial aid application. But what I love about AVID is that we we take that stress off of our students and we teach that process to them. Not only do we teach that process, we give them the skills to be able to utilize the resources that they're going to need to be successful in college. And so I always tell people my mama was doing AVID and didn't even know it. I have a very large family. Um, I am one of nine. Um, I have six brothers and two um, older sisters and we do spend a lot of time together. My mama's motto is that your, your siblings are your uh, first best friends. And on the weekends when I'm not here at school, um, I do like spending time with them. They spend time with me indulging in my pleasure. I love going to museums, particularly Southern History Museums. I also have lots of nieces and nephews. Um, I, as I said, I'm the first in my family to graduate from college and what I love most is that, that I've sparked that love for education in my nieces and nephews and they are now college graduates as well and so I'm very proud of them. My personal connection to these students is that I was one of them. I always tell them how fortunate that we are that we have this opportunity here in Horry County Schools but and what I love most is that I didn't have what they have like I didn't have inside people on a daily basis reassuring me and still in confidence in me but also in, still in the skills that I would need to be successful and then giving them the tools to move forward beyond this building to achieve their goals. And so I always think this is an amazing program, but what makes it amazing is that it's a family tree changer. You know, this, this limb of the family tree will now be able to boast a college graduate, and then that limb will produce more college graduates. And so we're not just changing lives, we're changing the whole family trees. When I look out at any event that we have and I see when we invite our families in to see the pride, whether it's our war ceremony, just no matter what we're doing, the pride that's on our families' faces, it just, it reminds me that we're doing the right thing. And it reminds me that no matter how overwhelming this job can sometimes get, I don't ever want to forget as a leader my purpose. I want to be a part of the work that helps our students achieve their goals. And so when I stand there and I watch that, I just, it just gives me chills thinking, oh my gosh, I probably have the best job of all of my friends. I know I do because I get an opportunity to do what I'm passionate about, but I also get to be a part of the work of helping young people, and that's what I love.